what's up you guys i see right here in this scene right here there's some little open um drawers right there you need a lock pick to unlock them in the videotape from the guest house and then once you're like out of the videotape like you'll magically like have Jesus. it open you know not, not, it won't look open but it'll be unlocked with your lock pick that you used in the videotape and it'll like as you see on the video right now it will take you straight to that drawer that you open from the videotape with your lockpick. Once you open it, boom, you get an amulet coin. That's your first one, right there. Boom. Alright, for this second one, you're gonna have to get your hatch key and run away from this guy. Once you get your hatch key, open this little hatch, obviously, the hatch key. Head down there, look for a lawnmower, and there should be a coin right on it. Just look for it, you'll see right now. Boom, there you go. Alright, for this third one, after you, you know, uh, assumingly defeated that guy, the father, whatever you want to call him, um, you open this door once you obtain that little thing from the photo frame or whatever, or statue frame, whatever you want to call it. Once you head through these doors, go to your left, right beside that phone, next to that cabin or whatever the fuck you want to call it. There should be an antique coin right inside there. Alright, for this fourth one. Alright, yes, yeah, so you see grandma there. I, I don't know, I'll just see what she does. She just looks at me left, right. We're gonna wanna head to this room, as you see on this on the video. Easily, if you head towards this, this like, I don't know what the fuck you call it, drawers, <laughs> you'll find an antique coin above it next to the bobblehead. And for this fifth one, just leave out that same room. And you're going to want to go to your right, as you see in the video, into this bathroom before you fight the father again when he comes back to life. You're going to want to head to your right, and then there's going to be this toilet. It should be an antique coin in there. Take note, this only these coins are only for easy and normal mode. I'll do a separate video for the madhouse ones. But once you're done with your meal right here, and then whenever you're done, you know, taking your, your dump, or whatever you want to call them, you see this room with the deer? Yeah. You head to this next room. It should be a coin right in this exact spot you're looking at right now. Alright, for this next one, number seven. This is also going to be the main house, but in the processing area, which most people think of it as a basement. So, right here by the meat room or whatever, there should be a coin that's really hidden. It's inside the little square spot. I don't know. The broken hole. Literally right there as you saw in the video. Alright, for this next one, it's headed towards the yard. So pretty much once you get all your three dog heads, you head out to the yard. You turn to your right. Once you go down those steps, you should go through all those and you'll find the coin. For this ninth one, it's going to be in the yard as well, except inside the trailer. Once you open the door, turn to your right. Easily you'll find your coin next to the 44 magnum where you put in your coins yeah so number 10 let's see you uh killed all these bugs destroy the little hive right there it, you open a little path right there you know it's part of the mission either way you have to go there and grab the statue thing i don't know what they like to call them but you'll find a coin right there on your left just Follow along with the video. I honestly don't know why I'm talking. I guess to keep you guys company. But um, number 11. Once you get this, you know. Once you get it. Just swing it, swing it, swing it. You're going to want to walk across there. Once you open this door. um, Honestly, if you had your, what is this, what are those called? Cycle meth? I don't even know what the freak they're called. But I had one on. You can easily see one right there with an icon on it. Yeah, you can find an icon right above that toilet. Alright, for this number 12, you get once you obtain the crow's key, you get to, to upstairs from the old house on the second floor. You're going to want to go right here where you do end up setting up a lamp or open that door. There should be one on your right. <laughs> Voice crack. There should be one on your right and you should find a coin. Alright, this part, this part you got to be really careful. There's these bombs, you know, in the barn. Eventually you would see them a little bit more before this, you know, you get to the point where you find the coin. But there should be a coin. Just be careful, you know, sh 
If you guys want to, you can shoot at them or you could just instantly die. Because you literally instantly die once you hit one of them, all of them blow up together, and then you're screwed. And you don't want to start over, do you? Just shoot them whatever order you want. Or if you want, try to dodge all of them. But this should be an enemy going inside the little room, inside that little drawer. And boom. Alright, for number 14. All right, this is on the testing area. Once you def once you kill that big fat dude that he puts on you, you're gonna go, you know, up the elevator. And you once you see this dead body, burnt body, I don't know what the freak he is. It should be an amulet coin right in front of him, ahead, not in front of him, but ahead of him. It should be one right there, as you see. All right, this one's tricky. Just you know, bear with me. This one's difficult. Like it's hard to like tell. But just try to see if you can, you know, get along with the steps I'm going through. Like, this part was really difficult. <laughs> it, it was difficult to understand. But just try to see, you know, just follow that little hole right there before you jump down. Just, like, follow the way I'm walking. Just walk back. Walk back towards the coin. I'm, I, like, I'm literally guiding you guys through the coin on this part. Because this part was, it would probably be difficult to understand. But just know it's right there, as you saw. So I'm going to just walk back over here. I'm going to go show you guys a little bit more of what the actual entrance was. That That's this, you know, path right here was before you get to the Amulet Coin. Where I came from, from where that hole was, was after the path. Right there on your left. But you're going to want to head right toward the dead end. And yes, this is in the wrecked okay. ship. And just know you cannot go back there. Like how you can go with the main house and the old house. Just know you can't go back there. So it's like a one time thing before you like pass this part. All right. So once you see that girl, talk to her for number 16. Once you finish talking to her, you're going to walk up that, not walk, <laughs> climb up that ladder. Excuse me. You'll find this dead body. You'll just jump down. Look to your left. You should find an antique coin. As you can see in this video, it's literally inside the water. You cannot tell unless you look at it. You'll see an X and you just hold on to it and grab your antique one. Alright, for this next one, this one's for number 17. You're gonna need a lock pick. Alright, to get this lock pick, it's gonna be in the second floor. There's like these bunk rooms before this, and you just pass those by. You go into this small room, and it, all it has is a ladder, and it's all dark and brownish looking. You head, walk up that ladder, look to your right. You should see, um, I guess a box, if you want to call it, a container. You you just grab it and instantly you'll find a lockpick. Once you get this lockpick, you head back to literally where the control room is. You should see a box. An orange, reddish looking box. I don't know if you're colorblind, I'm sorry. But there should be an, a box right there. Obviously, we all know you can only open it with a lockpick, so... You don't want to lock pick that and you'll see your antique coin. This is gonna be in the wrecked ship. It's gonna be like probably the bottom floor, I believe. All you, but you're really gonna need one of those. You see that? You're gonna need one of those liquid bottle things. Acid or whatever. To open this up easily. You can easily get this one. There you go. That's number 18. As you guys can see, I've opened my steroids and the stabilizer. But for this last one, there's a 44 Magnum. As you can see, I still had one NT coin. So pretty much, you only need 17. I'm not sure if there's like a secret thing you can use with one NT coin. Maybe there is. I don't know. But I hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys in my next video. Peace.